Hi reception, welcome to another phonics video. Okay, now I hope you've got a piece of paper and a pencil or a whiteboard and pen because we're going to practice writing some of those tricky sounds we've learned so far. Okay, so the first one we're going to do is our letter K, our K sound. Okay, so for this one, we go down the kangaroo's body, tail and leg. Let's try it again, ready? Down the kangaroo's body, tail and leg. Pause the video and have another go for me. Okay, are you ready? Let's go into the next one then. So this time we're going to look at the letter E. So the sound is E. Okay? We have to lift off the top and scoop out the egg. Let's try it again. Lift off the top and scoop out the egg. Pause the video and have another go. How did you do? Good? Well done. Okay, let's try the next letter. This time we're going to write the letter H, our sound. Okay? For this one, we go down the horse to the hooves and over his back. So down the horse from his head to his hooves and over his back. Have another try for me. Well done. Okay, you've got one more letter to do. This time we're going to write the letter B, our B, B, B sound. Okay, so we start at the top, we go down the boot to the heel and around the laces. Let's try that again. Down the boot to the heel and around the laces. Have another try. Excellent job, well done. Okay, so today we're going to be thinking about some of our tricky words because they are just that, aren't they? They are tricky. And we learnt three new ones just before we broke up. So we're going to practice those and then we're going to play a game with them. Okay, here is the first one. We just need to learn these because we can't use our sounds, remember? So this is the word go. My turn, go, your turn. My turn, go, your turn. Well done. Okay, this time the word is no. My turn, no, your turn. My turn, no, your turn. Brilliant, okay. And the last tricky word we looked at, which we used yesterday in our phonics session, you correctly guessed, didn't you? This was the word that was missing, is I. My turn, I, your turn. My turn, I, your turn. Okay, so I'm going to muddle them up. Are you ready? Your turn's coming first. Your turn. My turn. No. Did you get it right? Well done. Here comes the next one. Your turn. My turn. Go. Brilliant. Do you know which one was missing? You do? Was it this one? Your turn. My turn. I. Well done. So we're going to be reading some of these in some sentences very soon. Okay. You need your piece of paper and pencil again or your whiteboard and pen because we're going to be drawing our phoneme frame. We're going to practice writing some words that might have some of these letters in. Okay. So we draw our rectangle and we split it into three boxes with our two lines. One, two, three. Okay. Now remember, we put sound button underneath any letter that is one letter on its own that makes one sound and we draw a line underneath if we have our digraph. So two letters that make one sound. All right. Okay. The first word is hop. Hop. Think about each of the sounds. One sound in each box. Pause the video and have a go. Hop. Okay, what's the first sound we can hear? <sighs> Do 
What's the middle sound? Hop. Off. What's the last sound we can hear? Hop. 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 Well done. Now either draw yourself another phone in frame, or if you're lucky like Mrs. Hamilton, and you have a whiteboard and a rubber, you can get your phone in frame ready for the next one. Okay, your next word is fat. Fat. Pause the video and write it in your phone in frame. Okay, are you ready? Fat, what's the first sound we can hear? Draw the flower and then the leaf. Fat, fat. Ah, sound. And the last sound we can hear, fat. T, t. Well done. Ah, t. Fat. Brilliant, well done. Okay, get the phone in frame ready again. Okay, now I'm going to give you a clue. These two words will have a digraph in there, okay? And they will be ones that we have practiced before. So your first word is mess, mess. Pause the video and have a go. How did you do? You ready? What's the first sound you could hear? Mm. Lazy mountain, mountain. Well done. And the next sound? Meh, eh. Well done. Mess. Oh, now I remember when we looked at this before and we know this sound comes at the end of the word that it's usually a digraph, which means I need to write two of them slither down the snake and I need to put my line underneath to show that it's two letters that make that one sound. M -s, mess. Brilliant job, well done. One more word to go. Get your phone in frame ready. Okay, your last word is sell. Sell. The lady selling some flowers, sell, sell. Pause the video and try and write it in your phone in frame. Okay, you ready? So what's the first sound? S okay, now as that comes at the beginning, we just need one of those. It's not our digraph. S L F. And the last sound? Oh. Now this comes at the end of the word and it's our digraph again, isn't it? Sell. So our line needs to go underneath. S -e -o. Sell. Brilliant job, well done. Give yourself two claps. Excellent effort. Okay, we're just going to finish with reading some sentences with our tricky words in. Okay, here's the first sentence. Tricky word, I. This is that hard word we need to know. Put, I, put, a, well done, at, hat, on, on, a, d, o, o, doll. I put a hat on a doll. Brilliant work, well done. Here comes your next sentence. Are you ready? Now this one looks slightly different because we have a capital version of this. So this is our tricky word, go, okay? Go and at, cat, a, brilliant job, k, at, cat, well done. Go and pat a cat, fabulous. One more sentence to go, here it comes. Capital at the beginning, so this is our tricky word. No. No, it, it, it's, is, not, not, 
hot, hot. No, it is not hot. Certainly isn't at the moment, is it? It's quite cold. Okay, well done reception. Brilliant week of phonics learning, well done. And I'll see you next week for our phase three sounds. Yay! Okay, take care.